We're here. We're checking up on the baby. Baby has no name. Baby has no, well, has the sex, but we just don't know the sex, right? So, this well, is we the, have the, the sex in an envelope. Oh, yeah. We do have the sex from the blood work that I got at 13 weeks. So, they do the blood work, and my insurance covers it. So, um, this is the anatomy scan. So, this is going to find out the sex, too. But we're going to put an envelope. Like, how boring would it be to just find out here in this office? I mean, it's a nice office. office is nice, though. It's a nice office, but she's going to be like, oh, it's a boy. Oh, it's a girl. I'm just going to be like, thank you. Have a good day. <laughs> <laughs> so today I'm 20 not today but I'm 27 weeks pregnant so you know what that means pregnant ladies pregnant ladies it is time for the glucose tolerance test beverage I have to write down the time that I drink the drink it is now 102 shaking it real good now most women say how disgusting it is they threw up I mean when I had drank this with rain it was okay rain just suck it <laughs> it was I didn't think it was that bad it tastes like tang to me but they say each pregnancy it's a different reaction so let's get to drinking <laughs> <laughs> All done. Ten ounces in one minute. One minute. Okay. Hey guys. Today is May 26th. You know what that means? I am eight months pregnant today. Whoa, big mama. Doctors, for my eight month checkup, check on baby and see how she's doing. Hope she's growing healthy and strong. So, go inside and see. Okay, guys, so I'm 32 weeks pregnant today. So, I decide the, the nurse said, Can I do a urine sample? my mind is everywhere today was my last day of work i had to clean up and get all that stuff together i go in the bathroom i go to use the bathroom to go pee and guess what i pee in the toilet and not in the sample cup <laughs> I, can't. I feel like an idiot truly i feel like an idiot has that any has that happened to anyone before like i feel like a true idiot but sit here and drink this whole bottle of water so I can go before I leave. <laughs> that never happened before. My mind is just everywhere. I just, oh, Rain is sleeping. She's been up since 7.30 this morning. And uh, yeah, now we're waiting on the midwife to come in and check me out. This is a Northside Women's Center. So you get to see different doctors and midwives every time you come. I love this place. It's great. It's excellent. And um, only if you have like complications do you get assigned a doctor being thank god I don't have any complications so every time I come I get to meet a new midwife or a doctor here uh, mainly 
they all know me because I was here last year with Miss Rain. <laughs> I have been suffering. I don't know if any of you women have this um, hip sciatica pain where it's in your hip. It feels like electricity, like the strongest jolting pain that just stabs and turns and wrenches all in your hip, all in your lower back, all into your butt cheek, and down the back of your thigh. Eight months a day, hey. I'm eight months a day, hey. 32 weeks a day, hey. Rain is snoring. That's how tired she is. <laughs> Kiss the bump. Woo. Okay, so I'm done with my appointment. And the doctor basically, I told her about the sciatica. Of course, take an Epsom salt. They recommended um, the maternity band belt. Have any of you ladies ever tried the maternity band belt? Uh, I, I think I'm gonna try it out this time because this pain is so bad. I know you know I am always by your side. Been years ago since we met that very first time. And still you float my mind, the girl that cheated me. Focus, are we focused? Are we focused? Yes, we are focused. So I'm 34 weeks. And today I have a sonogram because I remember back when I was like 20 something weeks, they wanted to remeasure the baby's head and see her progress and her growth. So we're going to check. I had this appointment about three weeks ago, which I had to keep constantly changing. So today, Finally, I'm on time, <laughs> and I'm gonna get to see the baby's face today. I'm excited. So. So, finished the sonogram, and we're waiting for the doctor just to confirm that everything looks good. They were a little worried about the baby size of the head because we've traveled to the Caribbean um, and they're worried about Zika. So, you know, with Zika, the babies are born with the small heads and stuff. So, that was a little bit of a concern. So, that's why we had to get the sonogram done. Yeah, but now she's measuring in, what'd she say, 17th through 21st present? Right. Um, so, everything is looking good. Today I am nine months, 36 weeks. You think the time came quick, Rich? She's growing. Feels like it just got pregnant yesterday. Of course, because he's not the one carrying the baby, right? <laughs> We're gonna say it bad at all. Not bad. It's not, no, it's not bad. It, it, you know what's bad? The fact that I literally have to pee. Like every 20 minutes, I'm always having to go to the bathroom. And at night, really uncomfortable. And then I have that hip sciatica pain I was telling you guys about. I did go out and I bought the band, the maternity band, and it really does help. Instead of me like holding her from underneath here, this is not the band by the way, this is my seatbelt. I have the the, um, the band on and it really gives me a lot of support. And, then, and I can like last a little bit longer walking in the stores and stuff like that.
Knock, knock, knock. Who's there? Well, you're supposed to say who's there. Okay, who's there? 200 pounds. You're 199. <laughs> that was a joke. You, you're supposed to go along with it. Though. You're going to say 200 pounds too. I was, like, was going to say, uh -huh, I'm not 200 pounds yet. I'm 199. That joke was really terrible. But after I eat lunch today, I'll be 200. Oh, you're only a, You're literally a burger away from 200 pounds. 200. Rain Mama's almost 200 pounds. Yeah. Mm, 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 mm. Go Rain, go Rain, go Rain, go Rain. We 200. You 200 pounds? No, but Rain just made 20 pounds. Wow. Ooh wee. Big yeah. Yes, 20 pounds. Go 20 pounds. Go 20 pounds. Go 20 pounds. Go 20 pounds. Go, go, go 20 pounds. Why am I always dancing on the doctor's boat? <laughs> Too funny. So, 37 weeks pregnant today. What about this side? Okay, we're about this side. <laughs> okay, so 37 weeks. I'm late to this appointment. I'm glad they were able to take me in. Of course, I'm late to everything. I'm never on time. I'm not a punctual person. But that's all right. I'm here. And they're gonna see this was all that. So it looks like we're by ourselves. But we're actually just walking right next to the car because Rain fell asleep. So we're not living the life. I mean, we're living a life. It's still a rich and jazz life, but you know, not kid free. <laughs> Today we are doing my maternity shoot finally. There's no place I'd rather be here in this world. Cause I have no doubt and I know she is the one. I guess it really was giving up on love. And I tried to block those feelings off. In a millisecond, and it all came back when I thought that everything was lost. She knew she was playing with the ring the other day. Where was that? Sleeping? <laughs> Okay, so we did a change of wardrobe in 90 degrees. Now we're out here, Purple Gang. How you gonna get those shoes on? I need help. Oh, you need help? Okay. All right, let me help her. What are you using? A diaper, the most absorbent thing for all this sweat. Did you buy those diapers? Of course I did. Well, somebody gave them to me. <laughs> Diapers are not cheap. That's not a tissue. Where, where would you like me to stand? Over here. All the way down. It's just so real. People whisper and they stop. And you still blow my mind. Girl, to cheer me up. Yeah. But what's the deal? Girl, I still can't get enough. Your hair's a mess. Look, our makeup's still the best. 
photo shoot is over. Thanks to Brittany and her partner, Steve. She's in the car. Um, we really, really appreciate you taking your time out and being patient with us because I know no we, we're being nine months pregnant and 16 and having a 17 month old. She's 17 months now. Is no joke. So it's, it was and, and it's like 95 degrees out here. So it thank is. you for being patient with us. And she's with Stash. Stash Photography in Lawrenceville, gonna, Georgia. We're going to put her to, um, website on the link below. Yes. Check her out. She's great. Thanks. <laughs> So, guess what? I am. <laughs> it's 39 weeks. I am 39 weeks pregnant. Let me move the camera a little higher so you can see. 39 weeks pregnant. I'm due next Friday. So they're gonna check to see how dilated I am. With Rain, I wasn't dilated at all. I wasn't even dilated when I went to labor. So, we'll see. 39 weeks. 39 weeks. She better stay put at least till Wednesday. That's when my mom and my sister and my niece come. So I just hope I don't have to give birth over the weekend by myself. Well, Rich will be there, but it'll be scary if he's at work and I go into labor. So hopefully, please hold off till Wednesday. I just been feeling real sick and tired for the past two days, just stuck in bed. I've been in the house. This is my first time out. But I look cute though, right? <laughs> okay, I just got in the truck. Richard and Rain was dating downstairs for me. Um, what they say? My midwife, what she say? She said that she didn't want. I wanted to see how dilated I am, but she said it's best not to, because she's like, you want to have her this weekend? I'm like, no. <laughs> yeah, she's when like, you said that, that, that didn't make sense. If they check you, that's gonna stimulate you. Yeah, she said I don't want to stimulate anything, so. It's best just not to know. I was like, yeah, don't you're take right. Much to push you over the edge these days. Right. So nothing goes in. This is a family vlog. <laughs> and we'll just wait until I do it, go into labor to see how dilated I am. I mean, it really doesn't matter. I thought that that was just something that people naturally check, but um, yeah, I don't want to stimulate anything, so I'd rather not know how dilated I am. We want her to stay put. Stay put. I know you know I am always by your side. Been years ago since we met that very first time. And still you float my mind, the girl to cheer me up. Uh, I know you know that I still can get.